guys, welcome back to The Bookish Brits. Um, with me, Fiona, today I'm going to be doing tag. So I wasn't actually tagged by anyone, but um, Andrew saw Sarah Churchill do this tag and was hinting on Twitter for me to look at it. So I decided, you know what, I need an idea for a video anyway. Let's have a look. And I said I'm going to do it today. So this is the Shelves of Fate tag. It was created by Emily Jean, who I'll leave a link down below. I believe there's quite a lot of mutations of it now, but I think I've got the original coordinates, I think. But we're using these anyways, so let's get on. So the first one is Love of Your Life, and that is third shelf, fifth book. So what I'm doing is I'm not including this shelf, because it, this bookcase, because it is entirely manga, and I'm not including this bookcase because I haven't read any of those. So predominantly these two bookcases behind me. So, third shelf, fifth book. One, two, three, four, five. And that is Crescendo by Becca Fitzpatrick. So apparently Patch, or, you know, Nora. So either Patch or Nora, probably Patch. <laughs> Not so much Nora. Um, it's the love of my life, apparently. Hmm. The next one is Person Who Makes Your Life Hell. And the coordinates for that are sixth shelf, sixth book. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five, six. Oh, okay. So apparently someone in this makes my life hell. Um, I don't know who though. Because I like Paige and I like Warden. I suppose Warden could make my life hell, in a way, but then not, I, I don't know. And the next one is your best friend, and that is First Shelf, First Book. Um, and that is Don't Look Back by Jennifer Armentrout, so, um, Samantha is my best friend, I guess. Um, I fairly enjoyed this book, so that's not too bad. Getting the numbers back and all that jazz. And the next one is Author That Writes Your Life Story, and that is Eighth Shelf, Third Book. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay. Will you look at that? I don't think I'd mind having my life story written by Veronica Roth. I think I could deal with that, as long as she didn't do anything too untoward. But I'm okay with that one. The next is the title of your life story, which is a flip, it's the third shelf, eighth book. Eight. <laughs> so, the uh, title of my life story is called Blood Magic and it's written by Veronica Roth. Um, interesting, I guess. Um, I, did, I did used to enjoy a bit of dabbling in the dark arts. And then the last one is Circumstances in which you die. <laughs> it is the lowest shelf and the fifth book. So this is my lowest shelf because there isn't actually any other books on those. One, two, three, four, five. So this is the sequel to Unraveling. So I die in a parallel universe, I guess. Or am I one of the people that goes missing? Maybe. I don't know. Um, so that's interesting. Um, like I said, I think there's some other variations on it, so it could have had different answers. But um, yeah, it's kind of interesting to see, I guess. Um, I'm not going to tag anybody in particular today, but it's nice to see any of the other bookish Brits maybe do it on their own channels. And yeah. So that's all for me today and I will see you in my next video. Bye!